or getting them to share with adults who start to behave like greedy children. And then I'll take two. One, two. At five, differences in personality begin to show in the way children respond to these unusual circumstances. You can see it in their behavior and in their heart rates and stress levels. But I really like these candies, so I'm going to take two. One, two. I like them too. You do? I'm going to give you one, but I'll take four more. No! One, two, You're taking all of three. it. That little boy was almost a little bit more intellectual. He was adamant when he had his expectations about sharing um, broken. And so he said no immediately. And then he sort of moved on. And he watched what was happening with the investigator. But he was really more adamant. What do you think about that? No. I'll take one more of yours. Whereas if we look at the first little boy. What do you think about that if I take all of them? You can see that he really feels what's going on. So he will experience that very differently in his body, too. I really like them, but I think I'll get a stomachache if I eat them all. Some of us react very emotionally to changes in circumstances. Our heart rates and stress levels soar, while others seem to have no trouble keeping their body under control. The characteristics that, that distinguish all of us are how we react to things and then how we recover after something happens. Those are called the core features of temperament. We can see them in six-month-olds, we can see them in five-year-olds. And in adults, it's a more refined set of traits, but the core is reactivity and, and recovery or regulation. Janet can even see these core responses, how extreme our reaction to a new situation is and how quickly we recover in the heart rate and stress levels of six-month-olds. If they were already there at six months, could these core personality traits start even earlier, back in the womb? Janet's experiments allow her to see how babies react to a change in circumstances, even before they're born. First, she provokes strong emotions in the pregnant mother by showing her a video about childbirth. As the mother's heart rate and stress levels change, Janet watches to see how the baby responds. Or she can take a simpler approach and surprise the babies directly. The mom is wearing the spa mask and the headphones, she's listening to music, so she can't hear the stimulus, but the fetus can. Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. All right, go. I, I could see her abdomen jump, in fact. Mm -hmm. You see the very quiet actigraph and then just that discreet mm -hmm. little jump. Fetuses startle to things, just like babies startle. Some babies, so that response, startle so much that they wake up and they continue to move. Some babies don't really react at all. And then some babies, like this one, moved, looks like they gave a very specific response to it, and then they went back to the, their own business. <laughs> 